Hey, this is Dylan from Safe Haven Music, and today we're checking out the new Sterling Dark Ray bass and comparing it to the American. Are they the same? Are they different? Let's see. So, first impressions on the bass, um, it looks honestly really awesome, and the quality of the Sterling basses have been going up over the years. I wasn't sure that they were going to make this into an import because I didn't know how many, how many of these Dark Glass Alpha Omega circuits to put into the basses that they had, but I guess they made a lot if they made this one. It's very, very solid. It looks awesome. Plays great. It's mostly the same specs as the American. So they both share the same neck woods and hardware color in the circuit. So they both have the roasted maple neck, ebony fingerboard, black hardware. They both have the same control layout with the volume, the distortion circuit EQ. So you have three-way switch for clean, alpha, and omega circuits. Distortion amount or level of distortion and the blend. So today we're going to dive into the different sounds of the Sterling Dark Ray and we'll see how uh, similar that they are. I have the controls laid out the same on both bases. Um, obviously volume all the way up. On the preamp for the bass and treble, the bass is in the middle. The treble is all the way up so you can get clarity on the distortion. The distortion where the light is is all the way up on both. And the blend is about midway. So first let's get some clean tones. So obviously with the Sterling basses, uh, the Sterling Stingrays, they're usually the normal original Stingray kind of contours and layout where they have the original kind of high mass bridge with the two bolts inside, um, the original Stingray contours and uh, hardware, um, whereas the American has more body contours. It's a little bit smoother on the side. They have the lighter aluminum hardware on the bridge and the, and the headstock. And the body woods are different too. This one actually has a Nyato, or cousin of mahogany, body. And this one features, it says hardwood. The neck on the import sterling is actually a little bit thicker than what I'd find on the American. The American one is a little bit shallower on the uh, neck shape, so kind of this one fills the hand a little bit more. Now let's check out the alpha circuit. <laughs> Now let's check out the Omega circuit. So between comparing the two bases, um, they both sound really good. I'm really impressed. Um, they are also very different. The neck shape actually is a little bit deeper than the uh, American one. American neck shape is a little bit shallower, so if you want a thicker neck, um, you'll probably like this one. Um, it's definitely more uh, filled in the hand. With the pickup magnets, um, this one has El Nico. The USA has Neodymium. The El Nico is actually more of the original or one of the more standard type of magnets that the Stingrays usually had with the USAs. So it has a little bit more of that like kind of nasally, very scooped kind of sound as opposed to the, um, as opposed to the Neodymium, which is a little bit more mid-rangey. With that combined with the um, original style hardware and the uh, body molds, this one definitely feels a little bit more like a more traditional Stingray base, just with the Alpha Omega circuit already in it, as opposed to the uh, Music Man Dark Ray, which is it's supposed to be more of the Music Man special uh, or Stingray special that has the accentuated body carve, the lighter hardware, the different pickup magnets. So this one is definitely supposed to be as modern as it can be. But if you want more traditional sounding Dark Ray, um, I would probably go with this one. And at a price point of $13.99 as opposed to $28.99, definitely a really good choice to go for. This has been Dylan with Safe Haven Music. Thanks for checking out the Sterling Dark Ray with us. Um, you can check out our other videos. We did another video on a five-string Dark Ray a while ago. If you like that or like our other videos, like and subscribe. Check out our website to see what we get in.